here's a Skype idea. Hi, Julie Wolf Skype coach here with another Skype tip realization. I've been testing new Skype versions all year 2014 and look, the API access control is still in Skype 6.18. Isn't that amazing? There it is. It's still there. Which is interesting because back in December 2013, Skype had told us that the desktop API would stop working. So I've been testing every version since to see if it still is, exists. Um, this turns out to not be the case. As of Skype 6.11, desktop API will be physically removed from Skype so that add-ons such as Pamela will not be able to communicate. This has not been the case. We are still seeing it in 6.16, 6.14, 6.11. Every Skype version this year still has it. Um, I just thought this was an interesting idea because uh, we've been focusing a lot on more shocking changes about uh, the Skype API, Skype Kit, and Skype versions even being retired. I will put these resources, um, this article and these videos, Skype Desktop API, Skype Kit News, um, old Skype versions and group Skype room moderation. Um, I will put these resources below the video, but it occurs to me that as long as we still have uh, our Skype, let's see, where is it? As long as we still have the API, it should be okay. The thing that concerns us is this um, article making way for new Skype. Let's see if I can find it here. Um, we are going to retire older versions of older versions of Skype for Windows Desktop 6.13. So and Mac 6.14 within the next few months, uh, which is in this article here. Let's see if I clicked over to it. You can get older Skype versions. A really good place to get older Skype versions is at See You on Skype. Um, on the Skype version page and you get instructions on how to avoid automatic updates. But we're just seeing, there's a video there too to help you. We're just starting to see that um, these articles, let's click on this article here, where uh, over at the blog, blogs.skype.com, where they're announcing that they will retire old versions of Skype. Right. So this is a, a concern and we're seeing that the moderator is not um, moderating, uh, not answering some of our Skype questions, some of our questions about this change and complaining that Skype room moderation is gone after Skype version 6.3, so 6.3. Um, 6. 6.10111131416 supposedly will not not supposedly I've tested it will not work in your Skype so I will put all of these um, blog posts and uh, resources and videos um, below this video for you to read but my interesting idea is if they're really only retiring everything below 6.13, hmm, we may be able to 
still use 6.13 and 4 and 1.4 and 1.8 um, to uh, with the, with the Skype desktop API. Hmm. Interesting Skype idea. I wonder when Shan is going to approve my comment. My answer to her has been waiting for three days. That's why I made this blog post and this I linked on my blog post I linked to please leave your replies to I put a thread on the Skype community forum so it would not be censored and you can come and participate. I'll leave the link below for you to come and read and, and uh, comment your views that we need Skype room moderation to work. We need old Skype versions to work because this harms Skype group chat moderation. Skype room moderation works only with Skype versions below 6.3. Imagine the ramifications. <laughs> Consider the ramifications of not having control of your Skype rooms. So Skype needs to fix that for sure. Hmm. See you on Skype. Julie out.